Arab countries are known for having some of the finest and wealthiest royal families in the world. Several other families have also made a fortune from the oil-rich region, giving their families the privilege of luxury. Today, we beam our searchlight on their kids and the luxurious lives they live. Prince Moulay Hassan, 19 years old. The Crown Prince of Morocco was born on the 8th of May, 2003. His father, King Mohammed VI of Morocco, and his mother, Prince Lala Salma, have two children, Hassan being the first and named after his paternal grandfather. They also have a daughter named after her mother, 15-year-old Lala Khadija. Morocco's royal family has an estimated net worth of over $9 billion. This allows them to conveniently lead a luxurious life filled with the best things the world world has to offer. Moulay being the next in line to become king comes with enormous responsibilities, and he is stepping up to his duties. He accompanies his father for important occasions within Morocco and outside as well, getting ready for the shoes he's set to wear when the time comes. He speaks multiple languages, including Spanish, English, Arabic, and French. In Morocco, he seems to be both popular and liked by the people, as two major public places have been named after him. One of them is Circus Circuit International Automobile Moulay El Hassan, and the second is the 12,000-seater stadium called Stad Moulay Hassan. Currently studying at the Faculty of Governance and Economic and Social Sciences, Prince Hassan received international acclaim at the 2017 One Planet Summit in France, being the youngest person at the event. But this is not the only public appearance that has distinguished the prince. In 2019, at the Royal Guest Palace in Rabat, he welcomed Prince Harry and Meghan Markle. Yet but his many responsibilities have not stopped him from enjoying a life of luxury. Popularly called the richest kid in the world, his Gulfstream G650 jet is one of the most expensive jets owned by anyone, costing a whopping $67.4 million. It could seat four crew members and eight passengers. The interior is well designed to give the best comfort to the prince during travels, and is also fitted with a $20 million J Music missile defense system for security. This is not far-fetched, as his royal status warrants extra safety precautions. The Gulfstream jet also has a special plate number, CNAMH, which means Altesse, translated as Majesty. The Crown Prince of Morocco is currently pursuing his dreams and aspirations in the aviation industry, learning to fly planes. His warm and humble demeanor remains worthy of note, and continues to endear him to many. In 2017, a group of Palestinian children visiting Morocco were welcomed by Prince Hassan. It is hoped that his outstretched arms will extend into his administration as King of Morocco and Supreme Leader of the Moroccan Armed Forces when the time comes. Prince Hashem bin Abdullah, 17 years old. On the 30th of January 2005, King Abdullah II of Jordan and his wife Queen Rania welcomed their fourth child and second son. He's the second in line to the throne after his brother Prince Hussein. Hashem is named after the lineage of the Islamic prophet Muhammad. Muhammad, the Hashemite family. It is said that he is a direct descendant of the Prophet, specifically the 42nd generation. Unlike his brother, the Crown Prince, Hashem has a very low social profile, with very minimal social media presence and very few public appearances. However, he seldomly appears on his mother's Instagram account, with over 7 million followers. The Prince shares the same birthday as his father, the King of Jordan. Being the last child of the family, he does not make many royal appearances. But but as he's gradually advancing in his teenage years, this is set to change, and he will be seen more often with his father and brother. Hashem was born at King Hussein Medical Center, Amman, named after his father, and now there is a hospital that has been named after him also. It is the Prince Hashem bin Abdullah Hospital Aqaba. He is growing into a fine gentleman and is currently invested in his academic studies. He already has a legacy laid ahead of him, as his royal family appears to be down to earth and not overly entrenched in the nuance of royalty. In one video, the king is seen riding on a freeway with his wife and two of his children, which is quite uncommon for someone of royal pedigree, especially the king. So, as Hashem comes of age, it's unlikely that he will have a flashy lifestyle or a penchant for living large. His already low-key profile says a lot. Prince Abdul Wakil, 16 years old. The prince was born on the 16th of June 2006 to his father, the Sultan and Yangdi Pertwan of Brunei. 
Omar, Hassan al bolkiah ibn Omar Ali Saifuddin III, who is one of the richest men in the world. His estimated net worth is said to be about $20 billion. His mother is Azrinaz Mazhar Hakim. Prince Wakil was born into premium luxury. To explain this well, we'll need to take a closer look at his father's assets. The Sultan of Brunei is said to have the largest private luxury car collection in the world, with about 7,000 cars, all estimated to cost over $5 billion. Think of all the luxury cars in the world, and the Sultan of Brunei most likely has them all in his garage. From Ferraris to Mercedes-Benz and Rolls-Royces, he has an assorted collection of custom-made vehicles. It doesn't stop at cars. The Sultan's private jet, popularly known as the Flying Palace, may seem like an ordinary airplane from the exterior, but on entering inside, you are in for a shocking experience. The airplane cost over $200 million for both its purchase and the special refurbishments done on the inside. It has different compartments fully plated with gold, including a bedroom and a sitting room. All these cars and jets are available at the disposal of the Sultan's sons, and his eldest sons have taken after his love for luxury. One of his sons, Prince Abdul Mateen, has an exotic collection of animals, including rare white tigers. His eldest son and heir to the throne, Prince Abdul Malik, had such a luxurious wedding that it lasted 10 days and drew over 6,000 guests from all over the world, including members of royalty and political dignitaries. However, young Abdul Wakil has remained low-key, focusing on his academics. As he grows into a fine young man, he has a minimal social media presence. But as he grows older, perhaps his taste for the fine things of life will come alive. Rashed Saif Belhasa, 20 years old. Rashed is not a prince, or in any way affiliated with the royal family. His father, Saif Ahmed Belhasa, is a construction engineer in Dubai, worth billions. However, Rashed is a rich kid who has managed to make a name for himself outside his father's shadows. Born on the 5th of January 2002, he doesn't just live a luxurious lifestyle funded by his father, he has his own money. Also known as Money Kicks in his social media accounts, where he has garnered millions of followers on both Instagram and YouTube, Rashed has put his hands in many pies, including a thriving sneakers empire, a boxing career, and a YouTube channel. At first, he was simply known for videos showing him at ease with exotic animals on his family farm. Several people loved to visit, and he would host them on a tour until it got too tiring for him. Although he has now stepped out of his teenage years, he garnered fame at a very young age, and it all started with a birthday gift from his mom. She gifted him a pair of Nike sneakers. And the rest, as they say, is history. He developed a profound love for sneakers and began to buy more. For my dunk SB flamingos. And these are my California dunk SBs. Along the line, he decided to start selling some of his shoes too, and then acquired more shoes with the proceeds of his sales. This venture gradually developed into a full-blown enterprise as he began to affiliate himself with top sneaker manufacturers. In another video, today something special came. Uh, this came from Jordan Brand. This, because this is the invitation, they, they invited me for their grand opening in Dubai Mall. So check it out, it'll be the first year like a Jordan shop in the Middle East. Amassing deals and smiling to the bank. Rashad lives a luxurious lifestyle, which he often shows off on his social media platforms. He has a pension for luxurious cars, designer clothes, and of course, high grade footwear, and does not hesitate to record videos and take pictures, which he shows to his followers on YouTube and Instagram. His YouTube channel reportedly records about $8,000 in revenue every month, but this is just a fraction of his total income. As he gets more money from music videos, partnerships, ships, adverts, and endorsements. Currently, his net worth is estimated to be about $4 million. However, Rashed's rich kid status means that even without his enterprises, he can still live a luxurious lifestyle. However, he has chosen to leverage the privileges and opportunities he has to build his own wealth. With the freedom to drive his father's cars, he has also bought two luxury cars of his own. The first one was a Rolls-Royce Wraith when he turned 18, and the second one, just recently, was 
a 2022 Cadillac Escalade Sports Platinum, Rashad continues to amass wealth and influence, forging a name for himself. Mohammed bin Ahmed Jaber Al Harbi, eight years old, fondly called Maj, a coinage from his initials. Many will remember him as the little boy who took off his hat and extended his hand for a handshake with the erstwhile Queen of England, Queen Elizabeth. His father is Ahmed Jaber Al Harbi, a close friend of the Crown Prince of Dubai, Hamdan bin Mohammed Al Maktoum. However, their relationship has made room for a very uncommon friendship between Maj and the Crown Prince, with frequently posted pictures of the duo enjoying each other's company and engaging in interesting activities. They have left many puzzled. The Prince has referred to him as his best friend on his social media account, and they have several pictures documenting and sharing the memories built together. In an Instagram post, he wrote, Just in case you guys don't know, this is my best friend. From traveling the world on car cruises, attending important events, and casually getting a snack, Maj has found a friend in one of the richest and most influential people in Dubai. In a video, the Crown Prince of Dubai is seen teaching Maj how to drive in the Dubai desert. When he finally turns 18 and is legally allowed to drive, he'll surely remember the driving lessons he got from his royal best friend. They also attended the Royal Ascot in the UK together, as they both share a love for horse racing. Their other activities include jungle safaris, fishing trips, and exotic vacations. Each outing is never complete without a heartwarming picture of this unusual duo. While Maj is still an eight-year-old boy living his life dependent on the influences around him, he lives in luxury and opulence, mingling with top royals and international people. His Instagram account, which has over 700,000 followers, is managed by his parents and shows videos and pictures of him, many of which include the crown prince, Faza, as he is fondly called. Despite his rich kid status, Maj is still young, and very little has been shown about his preferences and disposition towards a luxurious lifestyle. We'll have to wait and see if he'll be a teenager with gold-plated cars and perhaps a jet to fly all over the world like his father and best friend, or if he'll still have the exquisite ordinariness and cute disposition that he currently portrays. And what do we know? Let the kid be a kid while he can. Thank you for watching this video. If you found it interesting, why not watch another by clicking a video on your screen.